girls, this is John with the Field Test Dummies channel. And today, we're gonna do a look at my EDC bag, everyday carry bag, go bag, what have you. Not to be confused with a bug out bag. It's two different things. Bug out bag, you probably have one for every family member in your house. A go bag is something you can throw in your truck when you're going to work or if you're gonna be out and about around town whatever and if something happens when you're out and about it's to get you back home or to get you where you need to go so that's the difference between a go bag and a bug out bag and here's my go bag and I know what you're thinking but John it's small it's not what she said just kidding. Um, yeah, it is small, but it does what I need it to do. I didn't want nothing big, especially because uh, the interior of my truck, I don't have a whole lot of room. So I wanted something that would fit nice and snug behind the seat and uh, be ready for when I need it. So let's dive into this bad boy. Okay, so. On the left hand side here, we got the Schrade, Molly webbed right into it. <clears throat> On the right, well, that's just there for extras. But on the right here, I have my uh, Pro 4 Tactical flashlight. Um, it's pretty slick. You can extend it and uh, it's actually pretty bright it really is I picked that up that was a budget buy but I got a good deal on it I think I paid like 10 bucks for it and then on the front here I have my little compass there a little d-ring so we'll just start diving into these pockets well, I guess I should say it's a sling bag. It just has one strap. Uh, it also has room for a camel back there if you want it, uh, which I thought about adding one, but at the same time, I don't know how much stuff I really want in here. So we'll do uh, this front pouch here first. And here we got a Leatherman's tool, the real deal. Not that cheap knockoff stuff, this old school stuff here. I have emergency poncho, and that's all I got there. So I got a Leatherman and a poncho there. In the next pocket here, oh yeah, I know you see it. Right there, baby. That's some good food. Also a cliff bar. Uh, has quite a bit of calories just for being a little bar. Give you some good energy. Extra pistol mag. I got, you know, this pretty much is kind of like my random pocket. So I got an extra mag, uh, some waterproof matches, a lighter, a pin, a Swiss Army knife, some electrical tape, and then uh, I ain't gonna put another stuff back on video. I won't make you guys suffer. On this top here. I got my mag for my 20, little 22 rifle I have. It's kind of like my uh, go go bag rifle, if you will, whatever. Um, main pockets here. Let's see what I got. This first little zip pocket. Brass knuckles. Um, then I have what nobody thinks of, tissue on the go. You know, if crap hits the fan or if crap hits your pants, you're ready for it. All right, what else we got in here? Some waterproof fire sticks. I'll probably do a review on these sometime, kind of see if they actually would work. It'd be kind of nice to know, know that in advance. Some more, these are store matches. These are a little bit different. Um, these are windproof and waterproof. I'll probably do a review on both those together, to be honest. 
and that's down there. Then of course, my med pouch, which you guys have seen on video. And then this was something I added recently, it was a atlas, um, size of a notebook. So it's not big nor small, it's an in-betweener, but yeah, someone recommended that and I thought to myself, well, that's really smart, I probably should have one. Then I have this little emergency kit, now what's in here is a glow stick, an emergency blanket, and uh, some paracord in there. And of course, I got more paracord. Binoculars. Just some cheapos, but they work. Then, of course, I got some ammo down in there. And then go in the back of the bag. I have this uh, Elk Ridge. It's a little hatchet. It's actually pretty nice. Just an El Cheapo, but it'll work. It has some built-in wrenches there, a little gut hook there. So, I'm sure they'll definitely get the job done. And now, some of this stuff in my bag, we will be doing a review on to see if it actually works. If it works, keep it. If it don't work, well, we'll have to replace it with something else. And then that's about it, realistically. Um, I don't think I have anything else in there. That's quite a bit of stuff for that small bag. And then, uh, of course, I got my 9mm I'd have on me. So, yeah, that's a quick look at my uh, go bag there. And I hope this video was helpful and maybe give you some ideas. There might be stuff I'm missing. If there's something I might be missing in my bag, um, leave it down in the comments. Let me know what you think. The only thing that I have... Well, not that I have coming, but I need to pick up. Is a, I want to get one of those life straws. And I believe Gary will be doing a review on one of those. So, stay tuned for that. Anyway, this is John with Field Test Dummies. Thanks for watching.